good morning and praise the Lord. Oh my good Lord, this is the day that the Lord has made. Today is the very last day of this month. And then this year, this is the 31st of December 2020. Tomorrow we're getting into a new year. And like uh, I promised yesterday, today we're just going to take some time in prayer, even as we end the year. And I believe that the Lord that hears us when we call is faithful to answer us, even as we just bring a prayer to him in the name of Jesus Christ. Um, shall we just pray? Let's just pray. Father Lord, in the name of Jesus Christ, Jehovah, we give you praise. We give you glory. We give you all the worship. We acknowledge that you are God. We acknowledge that you are Alpha and you are Omega. We acknowledge that you are God, the God that has been with us from January into December, God of 2020. We give you praise this morning. We give you the worship. We enthrone you, Jehovah God. We declare that you alone are worthy. You alone are gracious. You alone are loving. You alone are merciful. Your goodness is amazing. Your loving kindness never ends. Oh Lord, we bless you this morning and we acknowledge your Lordship. We acknowledge all that you have been even in our lives in this year, oh God. We have walked the journey in thanking you, just acknowledging you in different areas of our lives. And yes, Lord, we acknowledge that you have been good to us throughout this year. We thank you because you have preserved us through this year, Jehovah God. You have preserved us through the seasons of 2020. It's been an eventful year. It's been a year with so much. But Lord, you preserved us. You saw us through the year. We are standing here today and we are standing here this very last day of the year to testify that you preserved us, that you kept us. Through it all, you kept us. And so, Father, we give thanks to you today. We are grateful, God, for the many things you have done for our lives, individually, as families, as a nation, as communities, as the entire world. We thank you for the many things that you have done for us, oh God. Things that we have prayed for, some we have not prayed for. You have extended your grace to us. You have extended mercy to us, oh God. You have not let our enemies consume us, Jehovah God, because many a times so much rose against us, but you did not allow it to sweep us, oh God. You are the God of of the storm that has calmed the storm even through the seasons oh god in the name of jesus christ and so we thank you for fighting our battles we thank you for providing for us we thank you for healing us we thank you for setting us free we thank you lord for sustaining us we thank you for comforting us we thank you lord for the many things you have done us for strengthening us oh god we have gone through so much but we are standing here as testimonies that the lord god he was walked with us, that Jehovah God, you are there with us. You are there all the time. You are there all the way, Lord. That through the mountains, through the valleys, oh God, the mountains that we climb and the valleys that we went through, Papa, you are there all along. And like a singer says, that's the song, that's the story we will tell of how you brought the pieces together and just ensure that we were in one piece this far. We thank you, Jehovah. Thank you for 2020. And Lord, we know that this year we had expectations, we had plans, and maybe most of us, we never got to achieve them. We never got to fulfill them. We never got to attain what we had wanted. But I thank you, Jehovah God, because that which is of God can never be stopped by anything. And so, Lord, today I pray in Jesus' name that as we end this year, may our hope not end. May our confidence in you not end. May our trust in you not end. May we not kill our dreams with this year, Jehovah God, that Lord, Lord, we will still hold on to those dreams. We will still trust you. We will still look to you. We will still plan. We will still strategize. We will not stop at that just because things did not happen. Oh God, give us that enthusiasm, that excitement. Lord, give us that psych and the energy just to continue with that which we had. Oh God, that even as we get to a new year, we will not leave that and feel that things never became so it is no use. But God, we will continue in it knowing that the same God will walk through with us. The same God will bring it to pass in the name of Jesus Christ. 
And Lord, even as we end this year, Lord, I pray in the name of Jesus Christ that you will encourage somebody. You will encourage a soul. You will encourage a family. Oh God, I know it's been a crazy year. Many people have lost loved ones, left, right, center. But God, I thank you that you're still the God of all comfort, walking with them even as the year ends. Oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, we trust you with our lives. We trust you with our plans. We trust you with our ambitions. We trust you with our dreams. Every everything that we are. We trust you with it. And we know you are faithful to help us. You're faithful to guide us. You're faithful to bring to pass what you purpose for us in the name of Jesus Christ. And so Lord, even as this year comes to an end, I want to speak your covering upon your children. I cover every one of them with the blood of Jesus. And Lord, I thank you because no weapon fashioned against any one of them shall prosper. I speak peace. I speak safety in their lives, in their families, anyone that is on the road or in the air or in the sea traveling we cover them with the blood of Jesus we declare that no accident shall take any one of them in the name of Jesus Christ no attacks nothing shall take these ones away Lord in Jesus name you will keep your children safe and sound because you watch over them and you're able to keep them in the name of Jesus and so Lord we thank you we have come with a heart of thank you with a gratitude filled heart grateful for who you are, for all you have done, for all you are doing, and for all that you will do. We look to you, Lord, even as we end this year. We know you are the same beginning to the end. You are the same Alpha and Omega. You are the same God yesterday, today, and forever. Lord, at the end of the day, one thing that we are confident of, that you've loved us with an everlasting love, and you have drawn us to yourself with your loving kindness. That is our confidence. And so, Pastor, Papa, we thank you and we bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. Receive all the glory and the worship in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Allow me finish with this. We were singing this song on Sunday in church and it's, 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 been, an, it's been in my spirit all through this week. Or rather these days, the last days of this month. And it's as simple as this. The last bit says this. At the end of the day, at the end of the day, he loves me. Hmm. At the end of the day, at the end of the day, he loves me. And I pray that will just get into your heart and spirit. That when all is said and done, at the end of it all, Jehovah God loves you. Thank you so much. Thank you for always being part of the morning dew. We began some time towards the end of this year and you have been there with us. You have walked the journey with us and I am grateful to you. The Lord bless you for just being consistent even in this. Thank you so much for those who have subscribed this far. Thank you for being the encouragement that I wake up every morning looking forward to this because of you. So thank you for them that have subscribed. Thank you for them that get to comment whenever we put, we, we put up a, a video. Thank you for them that will always be there just to like the, the, the videos and even just to share. I really appreciate you and I know that even as we get into to 2021 the lord is taking us into a new dimension and together we will keep walking this walk we will keep journeying this journey but i am eternally grateful to each and every one of you thank you for being part of my 2020 you helped me fulfill purpose in 2020 and i am grateful to god for you in the name of jesus christ well i think at this point i'll just say happy new year oh god happy 2021 the year that god is still god you know the god of 2019 the god of 2020 the god of 2021 same god right now same god tomorrow same god years past so happy new year i know i will definitely um be with you tomorrow yes we're beginning the year with the morning dew we are not stopping at anything but i'll see you tomorrow in the name of jesus christ the lord keep you the lord bless you just end your year in style. If you want to do a victory dance, if you want to do a praise dance to the Father, whichsoever way you want to do it, just do it for your Father because He has brought you this far. The Lord bless you. I will see you tomorrow. I am excited. Thank you, Jesus. Keep well. I will see you tomorrow. Amen.